All right, today I want to talk about how to unify certain important guild roster manager settings among all the users of the add-on in your guild. For example, it would probably be important to make sure that everyone's sharing the information to the same ranks, and so you don't have uh, some people sharing new information with lower rank people and so on. So you can actually force this. So, so what I want to show you is you'll notice here at my guild information, there is nothing in the note right here. Now I'm going to come over here to the options and you'll see this little tag that stands for a global control. So you'll see that on any of the settings. Any of the settings that have this is something that you can kind of force onto all other players. Um, like for example the format of the timestamp that gets exported to your you know your officer note in most cases but really any note you want when a player joins the guild. Well, sometimes maybe it'd be useful if all the officers made sure they use the same formatting. Um, more importantly, let's go over to the sync tab. And let's say I want to sync with everyone except for the lowest rank. Um, that would, that's kind of how I have it set up. Some people like it set up to officers only and are higher. Um, we haven't really had any issues with trolling, so that's just one way I do it. Uh, Commodore and up, that's our officer rank, and so for the ban list, that's what I restrict it to. And then the custom note, I just kind of keep the same as the rest. Now I head over to the officer tab. Now watch what happens when I click the tab, and you'll see something down in chat. It'll notify you that you've never actually set uh, the global control uh, for, for these things. And so I want to add the join date to the officer note, not the public note, not the custom note. Uh, I want it to have this kind of header in front of it, the joined. And, uh, and then I could customize that if I wanted to. I'm just going to keep it the default. I do want to use this feature. It's especially useful in classic, a player being able to type exclamation point note, and then anything after it will get added to their note. That's just to prevent players uh, from having access to editing the public note. Uh, that's not really an issue in retail anymore, but it's definitely an issue in classic for trolls. And so that's nine settings in total. Now I'm going to show you, I'm going to come over to my other account that's in the guild, and I purposely set all of the settings differently. Different ranks are set. Uh, the custom note, I turned off this ability to add the note. Um, and so on. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go back and I'm gonna export the global control. I'm gonna confirm it, and then the first thing you'll see is here it is. It's been exported. Now I'm gonna switch over to this account, and you'll see that the settings have been updated on this account as well, and I can no longer change them. Now if I was an officer or higher, I could change them. But since I do not have access to editing that guild info, I cannot adjust them. They've all been unified. So this feature is now on, and so on. And that's just what will happen. So all the guild roster manager users will now have those same exact settings guild-wide. Um, of note, in Classic, there is one limitation here. When you make the modification to the note that gets the, the tags that get put in the guild info, um, it can take up to 60 seconds to refresh that. In retail, uh, it's near instant, but for some reason in classic, the server only lets me get that info once per minute. Um, other than that, uh, good luck. Hopefully this helps.